Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And they kick off here. Takes the shot. And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Seto. Well, it could be on for him here. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. He's driven in the corner. And they need to get tighter. Surely the equaliser. Well, still an issue here. It has to be, surely. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Who's going to get on the end of it? Oh, can you believe what we've just seen? I think we're going to be viewing that goal time and time again. Well, as you can see, they don't come much better than this. It's a goal of the highest quality. Wonderful piece of skill. So the ball is rolling again at one all. He's got space. And high marks for that pass. And getting in there to intercept. Oh, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. And there it is, the half-time whistle. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they... And nicely struck. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. He had to score, and he does. 
We'll just take another look at this because he reacts so well and he then keeps his composure. It's a good finish. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Oh, good play this, but fair play, that goes down as a very good recovery. Well, he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw in. And a substitution in the offing. Well-timed tackle. Seto. Budescu. Teammates available. But they took care of the situation defensively. An awful lot of green space to run into. Chance to play it in. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, threat over for now. Good tackle, take it away. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Baluzza. So almost at full time, and the home side on course to eke out a narrow win. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've certainly controlled the tempo of the game and just about deserve their lead but they've got to keep their concentration right to the end here. Oh, they could finish here, Stuart. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Atian. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. And he's clear his lines. And the counter looks on here, options available. Just the challenge that was required. The referee blows for full time, it ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end. Well, you know, when our colleagues in the newspapers come out with their grades for this match, he's going to get very high marks. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.